So these are my parachutes. They are my safety line. I like packing them myself. Um, that way I know it gets done right. This is um, when you're going 330 miles per hour down a thousand foot drag strip in less than four seconds. I want to make sure my shoots deploy. There's two, it's a combination of things that cut speed. That's pulling your foot out of that throttle and these shoots deploying. So um, shoots are very important uh, when you're going down a drag strip. We want to make sure those get out. They blossom. We also stagger ours. We do it for, you're talking again, 330 miles per hour when you're throwing your shoots that's about negative six g's on your body you feel so we like to stagger so that initial hit isn't so intense i'm matt Golo. i am the crew member that helps Brittany pack the parachutes um, i also put them on the car in the morning and take them off the car at night so when i start i attach the tether to the anchor on the car that is what actually keeps the parachute attached to the car once she deploys it. Um, next thing would be to put the cable in. This is what actually gets pulled out when she pulls the lever at the top end. Now, right now, obviously I pulled that out because she didn't come out. We have pins in it so that they don't accidentally deploy while we're here in the pit. These pins are removed before the car leaves the pit so that the chutes are live and ready to deploy when she gets on the track. Uh, we take them out earlier because then there's less chance of forgetting to do it, even though about six people check it. Um, and then I assist with packing the chutes. Primarily what I do is I compress the pilot chutes, which is the bright orange chute you see fly out before the main chute blossoms. There are actually three different ways these chutes can be deployed. First, what we want to have happen is Brittany pulls the lever, the chute is deployed. There's a automated system which if the car travels past a certain distance will automatically deploy the chutes with an air cylinder and then there are these cables that are attached to the wing so that if the wing were to somehow leave the car that would also deploy the chutes that would be catastrophic but make sure they come out so three ways they can come out fabric on these chutes is Kevlar, which I think is really cool. It's, uh, it's what the military uses uh, for bulletproof vests. So we're using the same thing uh, to make sure we stop.